All right, hi everybody, John Meadows here, and today we're doing another exercise index video. And I want to show you um, a barbell curl with chains, a chain curl. I know not everybody has chains at their gym, but if you do, this is a really good exercise. Typically when you do a bicep curl, most of the stress is, I would call it in the mid-range part of the motion. So really from here to about here. This is where it's really hard. That's why people get stuck right here and they cheat when they're doing the motion. One of the things you can do to make it harder all the way up to the top is add chains. So what I've got here is I've got one chain added. What's going to happen is as I curl, the chains are lifting off the ground and the weight's getting progressively heavier. So once I get through that tough part, normally it becomes a little easier, now it continues to be hard. Because again, the higher up I get, the more the chain's lifting off the ground. And as I lower it, the opposite is true. Now the chain's going onto the ground, it's piling up on the ground, and it's lightening up at the bottom. So this is a way to make the weight heavier all the way up to the top. Now at the bottom, the weight's not really loaded, the chains aren't doing anything, but it's just, it gives you, it's like, a, it's like putting a little turbocharger on your engine. This gives you a little bit more of the exercise. Now the other thing I would say is your form is pretty important on this, so doing a normal curl like this is great. But to get the full effect from the chain, you want to get a little bit of shoulder flexion too. So up, all the way up. So, and if you know your anatomy, you know that your long head contributes, of your bicep out here, contributes to a little bit of shoulder flexion. So I want you to come up and get all the way up to a full contraction, okay? Let me show you. These chains are 22 pounds. So I'm basically doing the barbell and 22 pounds. Um, each chain is 22 pounds. I'm not faking, those are really hard. Those are very difficult. So again, just a, just a way to, something for you to try, give you a little bit more tension on your biceps at the top when you do these. You could do these anywhere in the workout for your biceps, you can do them first, you can do them second, you can do them third. You can put them anywhere you want. I would typically do three sets here, something like eight to 10 reps, they're very intense. 